What's going on guys, Extreme Gamer 2 here bringing you my welcome back commentary from my wonderful break of YouTube. Actually, it wasn't really that good. It was actually really boring to tell you the truth. Um, I did live streaming. I tried out live streaming for about a month on YouTube, uh, on Twitch, and it didn't really go too well. Uh, the plans were expected is that I was supposed to live stream maybe every few other days and do the live stream, do my thing, and just, you know, have fun with players, viewers, followers, subscribers, all that. Uh, it didn't go too well. Uh, it actually went downhill and it was not really good. So I think personally on my uh, view, I'm going to stick, up, stick to YouTube. And I don't even know why I made that little break. Personally, because I was getting frustrated with YouTube and I needed to take a break. Uh, and plus, just to get catch up on some things in my personal life, be able to do some things I wanted to do, which I did. I went out and bought some things. I went out and did some things and, you know, just the whole shebang of whatever. So, um, so yeah, uh, I'm back and I'm staying. So I made my decision. I'm not going moving over to Twitch. I'm staying over to YouTube. And also, I'm bringing a bunch of cool things. Uh, I still have ideas in my mind that are not uh, officially going to be announced yet. There's probably one or two things that's going to be announced right now in this video, but I have maybe like five other ideas uh, to improve and make my YouTube channel a lot more better than it previously was. Um, but yeah, so let's get right into that. So, first off, I'm making my thumbnails a lot better. A lot, 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 lot better. Um, instead of just like with the Gary's Mod black background, Gary's Mod funny moments. And then some little stick figures or little characters just cut out of the picture. Um, I'm changing that. So there, these thumbnails, as you can see from the thumbnail that this video is using, if you don't know what the thumbnail looks like, quickly make a tab make another click onto my channel and look at the thumbnail. Does it look good? If it looks good, leave a comment down below and tell me if it looks good or if it looks bad. Um, I really don't think there's gonna be anyone telling me that it looks bad because personally, in my personal opinion, it's the best thumbnail I've ever made in my whole entire YouTube, YouTubing life. So yeah, I'm kind of really impressed with myself right now. So, um, and also, and I, I had a, a friend, a collab, collaborator, group, uh, guy, whatever you call him, Elliot, uh, Legender, uh, I think I said his name right. <laughs> um, but he made me a brand new banner, so that looks freaking amazing. I absolutely like it. I was originally joking around, like, oh yeah, can you make me a banner? And he made me a banner. I was like, oh my god. I was like, it looks beautiful. Gah! So, I was about to have a heart attack, but, <laughs> um, thank you for making that. I don't know how many times I gotta say thank you, but I said, like, thank you, like, a bunch of times, uh, before when he submitted it to me. Um, but thanks for making it, and I absolutely love it. Ding! Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I made that ding noise. Um, anyways, so, uh, let's get right into the, uh, some more ideas. So, for the second idea that I have right now, uh, like I said, there's not so many things being released right now because many of them are just still in my mind and I'm not even sure if it's gonna work. But the one that I know that I'm for surely gonna do is make my channel more interactive. I love interaction with people. Like, I don't look like it, and I don't sound like it. My interaction with people in public, like, in person, really sucks. But I like to do uh, interaction with people over the internet. Um, like, doing the live streams. Live streams, I could never get tired of it. Just interacting with everyone, playing with everyone, having fun, laughing, enjoying yourself. It was freaking awesome. That's why originally I started live streaming up again and kind of quit YouTube for one month. Uh, because I wanted to see how well it goes, and it didn't go too well. But I want to be able to bring back that interaction, that be able to play with your subscribers, be able to play with your viewers, and kind of just bring events to my channel. These are going to be called just public events, subscriber events, whatever you want to call them. I don't have it all fully thought out right now, but they will be coming soon to the channel. Um, right now, I have my own website, www. Uh, extremegamer2.webs.com and on that website there will be a link so when I set up an event 
uh, it will be tweeted out, it'll be posted on Facebook, it'll be Googled, it'll be on Google Plus, I mean, and it'll be on my YouTube channel, I'll make a, a video for the event. Anyone can join, but the only thing you have to do is go on that website, click on the link, wherever it is, in the description, in my tweet, wherever. Go to that link, go to the events, unless if it's already linked, then you're already at the events. And then you would have to submit your gamer tag and then check mark this little agreement just saying you understand the rules because there will be rules in the little event page. Uh, just make sure you understand that you're not going to be a dick because I will ban you if you are. Um, but yeah, so those are probably the only things that you're going to be at the reading. Uh, the event will explain what's going to go on, who's going to be hosting the server maybe, what's you know what we plan on doing. It's most likely going to be held on PC though, because my console uh, capture card for right now is actually broken. Uh, it's unavailable for me to use because it, something happened with the drivers and something happened with the actual hardware, the Elgato. Uh, something burnt out inside and it just it doesn't work. So it's really, really bummer for me. And uh, so my channel is kind of going full out PC right now. So this is being actually played on PC if you haven't noticed, um, because I don't think there's a T, there's an X, there's a 3 on a freaking controller. But um, yeah, so I'm very, very excited. Um, and actually, I've been playing Battlefield 4 on PC a lot, along with uh, Battlefield 3. And I do freaking really good. I mean, not good all the times. You all have those times where you just don't get in your moment. But this gameplay, I got in my moment big time. And this is not like console. It, you're, I'm using a keyboard and mouse to be able to play. I'm usually used to holding a controller. I've been playing for a few weeks now, and I have been doing outstandingly good. And I love it. I can't stop playing it. I'm actually in a clan right now, AOD. So, um, yeah, those are pretty. that's a pretty good clan. And uh, so, yeah, um, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I'm just really excited about everything. I'm excited about getting this YouTube channel back up. Uh, expect Gary's mod, some more Battlefield 3, Battlefield 4. There's going to be some Battlefield 3 gameplay, uh, funny moments with uh, Legender, or you could just call him AKA Elliot. Um, but uh, yeah, and I'm going to be playing all those fun things and stuff. Uh, for right now, I know there's a lack of Gary's mod. Gary's mod videos, they will be coming in the future. I'm not sure when, but they will be coming, trust me. Uh, we kind of have a lack of Gary's mod for Shirley in the group, but we're going to be fixing that pretty soon because uh, I need gameplay. Uh, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you leave a like in case if you enjoyed it. Also, comment down below what you think about these uh, changes because I think these changes are awesome. Um, anyways, and also, subscribe if you haven't already. I will talk to you guys later. Peace.